custom icons these are the icons that show up on your desktop okay all these little thingies are icons okay I'm gonna show you how to make your own icons so first thing you want to do is go to Google and find your image the icon you want to use all right if it's uh, uh if it's JPEG then you're going to want to edit it in Photoshop or GIMP, whatever you use to edit it, and you want to take out the background. Okay, you want to make sure whatever picture you have, whether it's JPEG, PNG, GIF, whatever it is, you want to take out the, the background. If you don't, it'll have your icon will have a white or black background, whatever, whatever background was in the picture. Okay, so you want to delete that. Use magic wand, just delete it. Okay, and then you want to save it as a PNG. Very important. If you don't save it as a PNG, then then it'll just have the same. It'll just have a white background, and it won't. It'll be like you never changed it. Okay. So you have to make sure you save it as PNG. Okay. After you do that, you want to open up your Microangelo Studio. That you that's in the description. Okay. You want to download that and then open it up. Okay. So after you download it and open it, you want to go to Create right here. Create new icon. And then you want to click import and find the icon that you had. So I'm going to use this one because just cause. Okay, so after you do that, you want to click OK. And then you want to do File, Save As. Okay, and it'll save it as an icon resource. This is the icon uh, extension. You want I want just want to save it as icon. Okay, I'm just going to save it. And uh, okay, so after you saved it, you want to find, you want to find whatever folder or thing you want to change the icon, and uh, you just want to right-click it and go to properties. Okay, after you go to properties, you want to go to customize and go to the bottom where it says change icon. All right, after you, you do that, you want to browse and look for where it saved your icon. So mine's on my desktop, which is probably where yours is going to be too. And mine is saved under icon right here. Icon.ico. That's the extension. And you want to click OK. And then click apply and OK again. And now, as you can see, your icon has changed to that icon. Okay. Um that's how you change and this is how you make your own icons and change it. Alright, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.